Venus beating Agnieszka Radwanska in the way that you did tonight was a truly inspired performance. What was the inspiration for it? Yeah, it, it's so recent. I'm still trying to figure out what happened. Just, it feels really good in the third set to be able to just increase the lead and, and keep that that on your racket. So I'm definitely still enjoying that win. And we've had some tough matches in the past. And today was tough as well. And it feels good to get through. It's been a while since we've seen you in the quarterfinals of a Grand Slam. For you, have you felt like this has been coming for a while and you've just been waiting for the stars to align? I know, stars to align so Venus can come through, right? Um, <laughs> all of that good stuff. But I've always played really tough in the majors. and. You know, some of the matches that I lost the last few years, they were really on the brink of, of winning. So at some point, I, I was thinking and hoping, OK, I'm going to convert some of those matches. And it's it's all worked out this year. And next up, you've got Madison Keys. I know you're a, a big fan of hers. And you and your sister Serena were her mm. inspirations to pick up a tennis yeah. racket in the first place. So, But it's great to see two American women contesting a quarterfinal, for one thing. I guess you're going to be hoping you can end her run. Oh, yeah. I, I've i enjoyed her game, and we've played only once, so we haven't had even a chance to play against each other. And I know she's in really good form and just a wonderful, nice girl and an unbelievable competitor. So it's going to be a really good competition in the next round. Well, many congratulations, and we'll let you go and enjoy what's left of Australia Day. Thanks. Thank you.